Hey guys, it's Brian and Jeffs. We're here with Blaze Bike. We're at Two Bucks on Broadview and Sprague. I got a, a text from Nate saying that he was up here drinking, having some beers. He sent me a picture of their wing menu and a couple of flavors intrigued me. So I said, let's come over here and check it out. You guys ready? Let's go. Alright guys, our wings came out, we're excited, we're here at Two Bucks, we've got, um, from mild to hot, we've got our, what was this, the maple maple bar bourbon barbecue? Yeah, I believe yeah. so. Maple bourbon barbecue, we've got our, um, this one is our signature, bacon buffalo. I and love then, bacon! <laughs> <laughs> and then we have a Cajun. Dry rub. So I think that might be our first dry rub, possibly. Could be. First or second, maybe. We haven't done. We have Jeremy of here today. Good. He's our guest. Oh, we'll I probably bet. introduce yeah. him. Ready to go? Jeremy, Ready you go? excited? Oh, I'm excited. All right, right away. We've got some some big ones, some small ones. Yep. It, it's a good size. A good, good sauce here. This was a small order, so there's about seven. Not bad. Um, for a sweet sauce, this is really good. Yeah, I, I don't think it, I got enough sauce. I don't know. I can see it being a little undersauced, but it's pretty good. I feel like uh, right now, with the amount of sauce I have on there, that's I just taste of a hint of barbecue. I yeah. can't even taste the maple. You know what? Honestly, uh, I actually like. I feel like it'd probably be perfectly cooked if it had a little more sauce, but it was a little dry for me. This particular wing that I picked up. So I'm gonna go ahead and give this sauce. I'm gonna give it a flat five. This wing. Okay. I'm close. I'd probably give it a six. Um, mine had probably a little more, more sauce. I would agree. It needed a little bit more on it, but sauce was good. Just a little light. When I was looking at the wings, I picked one that had a lot of sauce, so I think I did a better job of picking it. Um, so I thought it was a good wing. I, I really like it as a sweet sauce. It's not gonna be one of my favorite wings of all time because it's not spicy enough for me. But I'm gonna go with a 6.8. I really enjoyed, I thought that the flavor was really good. All right, the next sauce has bacon in the name. Cool. How could you go wrong with that? <laughs> Interesting. So if you bring that home, if you bring that home, what would you be bringing home? Be bringing home the bacon. <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid to ask, like, how do they get the bacon flavor in a liquid form? Yeah. I'm just thinking they just pour bacon grease on there. <laughs> Or they cook the wings in bacon for grease. Maybe. Jeremy, I'm gonna let you go first on the rating. I, of this I would one. probably go about a five and a half. I think I like the first one a little bit better. Um, again, it's just still lacking on. It should have had more sauce on it. I think the sauce isn't too bad, but you can kind of tell that they're a little dry. Um, five and a half. It wasn't bad. It was pretty decent. This one for me, um, I did. I didn't get any flavor. I didn't like the way it tasted. I think the wing was cooked well, so I'm actually going to go with a four and a half. I think it's a below average wing. If I ever came here again, I'm not ordering it. I was expecting more bacon. I was expecting more buffalo. Yeah, I'm with Jeremy. I, I felt like uh, I like my wings a little more saucy, and, and we're just missing it. Um, really disappointed. I'm, I'm going to go with a 4.7 on that one. Um, I don't know if I'd order that again. All right, our last flavor. This is Cajun. Cajun, Cajun dry rub. I love dry rubs, so Which I'm just weird because you it. like your wings saucy. Yes. There's no I sauce just, on a dry rub. You yeah, know that, right? Yeah, I know. But I like it flavorful. It's a little weird. Oh, okay. Guy. A little weird. Yeah. I'm gonna go with this one. It looks like it's got a lot on it. I'm gonna try this guy here. I like dry rubs. I had thought it had a lot of flavor. I'm starting to feel the heat. I'm gonna go with a 6.8. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna actually take. Uh, that's probably the best wing we've had here so far, and I'm gonna give that one a 5.7. Okay. Um, I would agree. I think that was probably the best one I had. Uh, I'm a dry rub fan as well, but um, it wasn't anything too special. Uh, the Cajun was good, not too hot. I'd probably go about a six and a half, um, slightly better than the first one that we had. Cheers, to that. All right, cheers. <laughs> All right. I need a refill. <laughs> 
Alright, since uh, Jeremy finishes, he gets the... The last of tequila. Oh, oh, man. The last oh, shot of tequila. Look at that, Jeremy. <laughs> Wow! How did that happen? Shout out to uh, shout out to Lisa for not taking shots. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, guys. All right. Nice. Well, we want to thank everyone for watching this week's episode here at Two Bucks. Uh, next week, Brian and I, and I are going to be back on the east side. Um, what's the place? It's in Madison. Romans, I believe. We're going to try to go hit up next. Recommended by a coworker. So, okay. shout out to Eric Khalil on that one. Follow us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, YouTube, subscribe to our channel. Um, thanks for coming. Jeremy, thanks for being our guest. No problem, anytime. All right. Have a good one, guys. Take it easy.